If you are tired of having a basic classic boring portfolio and you want something different, something unique, modern, creative, with 3D experience, very advanced animations, responsive, and every single thing about it is very beginner friendly and even went the distance to make it easy or friendly so you can rank higher in search engines, well I tell you, this course is for you because I will show you how to do all of this and create this absolute gorgeous portfolio and make sure I even teach you enough skills to build this and then you will be good enough to even create something unique and different because I'd say this is the most beautiful things about this portfolio which is that you can build the same portfolio but everyone can make it feel their own and I will make sure to do that so let me walk you through the website from start to finish as a start we will have this beautiful animated loading screen with loading bars, rotating shapes that even becomes part of the landing page if you want to and the whole loading process will be tied to the actual loading process for the page itself which is something very key right here. Also this is very customizable and I even make sure that I give you like 40 different sites for loaders like 300 plus shapes so that you can have like thousands of combinations, thousands of styles so you can actually make something create Creative, which is like a big part of our course to make sure you have something unique for you exactly. After this and in the landing section which looks absolutely stunning by the way we have mainly the most exciting effects and one of the coolest modern effects you see now in awards websites for example as we have just text that on hover it reveals an image with RGB effect, screwing movements which are done by 3GS and shaders and you don't have to worry because you could be someone who never worked with this but I will teach you everything from zero to hero easily and you will end up with this amazing effects second we have this good looking header with animated links that done only by CSS I repeat some of the stuff that you see right here are only done by CSS which is actually crazy you know we have also the contact call button which itself is an animated fancy one also done by CSS only same goes down for socials and the coloring effects you see right now and even the scroll down uh, icon it's done by CSS because I really wanted to show the power of CSS and you can learn so much tricks so much secrets about CSS that it's actually gonna be mind blowing and it's gonna show you that CSS is actually very cool and something and sometimes you don't actually need JavaScript and you will be sur surprised believe me and also I will show you like the full process the logic behind it and every line of code and what it does and what it means then we jump to the scale section and say bye to the old way of displaying your skills using progress bars like you can actually measure how good you are at something this stuff cannot be measured and there is no such thing that I know like 90% of JavaScript it's just nonsense so here we are and here we're gonna have a new modern way of displaying your skills in an animated moving text one to the left and the other goes to the right in harmony and it's such a good way to display your skills and show that you are actually different and creative. As a web developer showing what your clients say about you to your new possible clients is something very very important because it shows your credibility and that you are efficient and liked. And what better way to do this with a beautiful shadow card that first presents you and some of the key informations about you and then this customized swiper that I'm sure you find it very classy and creative and also it's mobile friendly so you can drag to switch between your views or use the buttons also to do the same thing also we have the pagination to show the progress and even you can use it to change and switch between reviews and also the review card looks amazing and you can see how the active one is unique compared to the other reviews and that they are smaller and blurred a bit and when you pick one it becomes now the active one and clear and you see this slick nice animation when you switch between them and also the swiper is responsive in fact the whole website is fully responsive and we will talk about this later and now for probably one of the most important parts of the portfolio if not the most important the project section should always be something very simple not confusing straight to the point and creatively displayed which what we actually did as you can see starting from the nice header that shows the number of the or the count of the project you can also have the date on the right or you can make it like a duration from like a certain date that you start working and the finished date also in the projects you have like your mockup image that shows some of screenshots from the actual bit that you have you can also use it as a 3d image that moves like a weaving animation or you can just use a normal image i actually 
prefer like a normal images because I actually feel like they look better and also for performance reasons. So like the choice is yours, but that's my preferable choice for that. And also we have like two links, two different links. And you see the first one is the source code link. If you have one, okay, so something we created before, we just made like few changes to it to give it like a unique look and feeling. Also, we have the link for the actual live website, which is done also with only CSS using SVGs and how create how to create like rotating text, eye blinking animation. So for so for sure, this course could be just animation course and it would do wonders, okay? And for the tags that represent like the tools used to create the projects, which also have this animated funny curved line under them, so you know that every animation we make, it's absolutely something extra gorgeous. I'll tell you that's for sure. Also, how buttons and links change with responsiveness is something quite impressive and it can give a different vibe in all different screens and devices. Also, having a frequently asked questions section is quite something needed, I feel like, because first it shows you are serious about your work and having some answers for some of the basic questions could save you a lot from all the random messages you get about some very basic stuff that this section will save you from and will save you from all the repetitive uh, questions and messages you will get okay and also we done it in a modern way as an accordion so you've done this before this is a bit different i feel like it's a bit creative and i will show you how to make that with javascript and also we'll learn about some few useful functions for sure Having a fully functional contact form is a must-have in every single portfolio, but having it done in a different creative way shows the power of a good contact form that actually look good and actually focus on being very easy to understand. You just type the basic information, name, type of service, email ID, and the message and a clear sending buttons you have there that actually works. And we will do it without the need of a backend and you will be able to receive your messages without any problems. And also we provide alternative email options Options for people who want to contact us directly from their email or the people who prefer a live chat with you on social media accounts so having all of this combined is a must-have combination with a little bit of cool effects and also this is beautifully responsive and looks even better in mobile phones also we will work on smooth scrolling so we can make scrolling the page feel smoother and better and more natural and I will show you how to bypass some of the most common problems that people get with smooth scrolling and end up removing it but with me we will conquer that and also I will have like smooth scrolling from links themselves to a certain section on the page so we can make header links more useful and feel more smoother. Also, I'm still working on other sections that have some of the nicest effects, but I still didn't publish them until I'm finished with them. And like every now and then, I will try and do something different and add few sections to the portfolio so we can keep something, you know, updated and you can have like new stuff with time. And to finish this, we're going to work on hosting this application on Netlify servers so we can have it online for everyone to see it and everyone to access it there. So what are you waiting for? This is your chance to be able to build one of the best portfolios out there and I don't see any reason to think twice.